across, hoping I get it. From North Carolina, the bull. Your color is cream. Um, I love, 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 love feel. It's just really to the freshman um, Jordan year. I hope you guys have a great, great, great fall. Here's my first point. Don't be afraid to interact with people. I know it's hard, so put yourself out there. I think it's very easy to like just stay so wrapped up in the life that you used to live before college, but college is just a whole different ball game. If you don't know how to communicate, if you don't know how to talk to people, you'll get nowhere, you'll be disappointed, you'll miss out on opportunities that you wish you could have had. College is about communicating, networking, like trying to figure yourself out, um, but also using those resources to help you get to where you want to be, where you need to be where you're destined to be. If you like to, you know, swim, play basketball, there's so many things here for you to do, community service-wise. Um, you just have to tune in to those resources. If you're UNC23, make sure you hit me up because I'm definitely here to help you navigate the campus, and I'm pretty sure a lot of other people will be too. Okay, so my second point is friendships and relationships. Remember that not everybody is meant to have this close bond or that college bond that you think that like it's supposed to be had your first semester of college. Very important that you find those people that will motivate you, encourage you, um, and just help you to like maintain your grades, maintain your mental health. Adding on to point one, find clubs and the, just those people that will be able to help. This will not come from one group, so don't expect your sweet mates to be your best friend. But they'll come and they'll be there and you'll see it. You'll really be able to tell who's your friend in college and who's there for you when you're at your lowest point and when you're at your highest. You get so busy in your own life or in clubs, focusing, studying. But make sure you just include like the people who have been there for you and make sure you stick with them, contact them. Thirdly, college is an adjustment and that's anywhere. Sometimes we get to college and think, oh, my school is as good as the school over there just because we see things and but I feel like every place has its own experience and every place is unique and it's what you make it. You also have to not be afraid to get out of your comfort zone. Like new people and new environment. Just immerse yourself. Clubs that I got involved in on campus were Hype, helping you by providing enrichment. That was like a community service club. We went to Dobbins Hill Community Center. I really enjoy if you want to be involved in community service. You can also volunteer at the Jackson Center. A lot of people go there to volunteer. And there's a lot of other opportunities. I got involved in the Black Student Movement, where I was the assistant treasurer, and now I'm the treasurer. Yay! Get involved in that. Oh, Harmonics is a good club if you like to sing. There's a lot of organizations that you can join that will fit you. Um, the people are very welcoming. And yeah, your first week, definitely go to Fall Fest. You'll find all the organizations that you'll want to apply to, anything that sparks your interest. Definitely reach out beforehand to the, the treasurers, the presidents, the vice presidents, and they'll help you once you get here. I think it's also important that you use the writing center, um, the learning center. That was helpful. That helped me a lot. And if you're taking econ, econ A, definitely stay mm -hmm. in there. I lived in there my fall semester. Kim Possible. Kim, oh. Kim. Kim Possible and BioCell, those are very helpful. Those will be your resources. And definitely reach out to upperclassmen, especially if you're taking those core classes like Kim, Bio, Econ, um, what, Psychology, like the bigger classes, because like you will get lost in there and you'll need some type of guidance or get a tutor. So remember that college will change you. Um, so you have to be ready for that change. You have to embrace the change. And just like know that if you don't change, like then you're not growing as a person. And if you aren't growing, then you're not learning anything. It's important that you keep a growth mindset and just remember that you do belong here and that things in your life will change. And Carolina is hard, um, hard. I'm going to say that again because it's hard. <laughs> uh, know that you can do it. You can push through it. Um, I'm here. A lot of other people that probably feel like they shouldn't be here are here. And we're thriving. Just thrive. And remember that like one bad grade doesn't determine your future. Um, you can keep going. Like Just keep pushing through it, persevering. Pray. Reach out to other people. Ask for advice. Use your resources. Um, the writing center, the learning center find tutors, see counselors, anything.
So since you're coming to Chapel Hill next year, I bet you're wondering what can you do? What is there to do? Well, let me tell you this. It's nothing to do. But you will find yourself bored. You're just going to have to come up with a game night. We did a lot of those. Those are so fun. Game nights, get with your friends, play cards, anything. That's something simple. Um, no cost. <laughs> but um, there's Silver Spot. There's, like, it's a movie theater. Of course, you can eat up and, up and down Franklin Street. Um... There's a bowling alley, it's on 15501, which is in Durham, and it's called MC Bowling, that's fun. Um, there's other stuff to do in Durham, like downtown Durham, you could just like go walk around, sightsee, there's a 21C museum, that's really cool, you could go take pictures. Um, oh, South Point Mall, I went there a lot, that's my home, my second home, I love it. <laughs> Um, just sit up, walk around. They have our Urban Outfitters. If you like Urban, that's my favorite store. They just have a lot of stuff in South Point. Eating, mall, movies. And other than that, there's nothing to do. So you really need to find friends. Ooh. Or do homework and sit in your room. So I know emphasis on find friends. Because Chapel Hill can get really, really lonely. And who wants to be alone? Nobody. Nobody. Nobody wants to be alone. Overall, I think the lesson that I learned this year was that you have to keep pressing forward and walking in your purpose. It's easy to lose sight of who you are while being here because there's just so much going on. No, but you have to keep yourself encouraged. For real. Read the Bible. I don't know if you're a Christian, but do that. If you're not, do what you do. <laughs> do what you do, man. It's I know, I'm playing. Remember to love yourself. Love yourself. My favorite... What's in my face? Man. I don't think it was Elle Dot, though. Really? Oh, and another thing is, okay, the whole school year, I'm going to go out and be like, what is this? Every time. I promise you. <laughs> I promise you. You're going to say, what is this? Like, where am I at? What did I sign up for? Mm -hmm. But just know, on L Dot. That is what you signed up for. You will not be disappointed on LDOT. You might not even make it on LDOT. That's how. You feel me? That is a different story. But my favorite Carolina memory. I don't even. I think it will really have to be game nights because I feel like that's when you really get close to people. That's when you know get to know people, and that's really when you build those bonds. But if not, then then no, <laughs> there's no other times oh. except for like the individual times that I've had with people. Like I really do love all my friends, and I've made such great friends. So shout out to to Janelle, shout out to Alana, shout out to Deja, shout out to Liani. Shout out to my roomie, Maya. We made it through our first year together. And to Chaz, Kennedy, and London. <laughs> you know who you are, and I love and appreciate you. My sisters, everything. Like, I love y'all. Be happy, be prosperous, and live your life to the fullest.